Hi, this is Munson from Munson Music, and we're talking about how you can play a song by Avril Lavigne called Rock and Roll, and we're going to end up capoing this on 3rd fret. But we're going to start on an A minor chord, the way you play A minor. First finger is going to go to the B string on the 1st fret, second finger on the D string on the 2nd fret, and the third finger is going to go to the G string on the 2nd fret. And if you strum all those together, that sounds an A minor chord, and it sounds really, really sad. And then from the A minor, we're going to go into a G major chord, so we play G major. First finger is going to go to the A string on the 2nd fret, Second finger on the low E string on the third fret, and the third finger is going to go to the high E string on the third fret. And if you strum all those together, that sounds a G major chord, and it sounds really, really happy. And then from the G major, we're going to go into a C major chord, and we play C major. First finger is going to go to the B string on the first fret, second finger on the D string on the second fret, and the third finger is going to go to the A string on the third fret. And if you strum all those together, that sounds a C major chord, and it sounds really, really happy. And then from the C major, we're going to be going to an F major chord. If you know the bar F major, we'll talk about an easy way to play this in a moment. When you take your first finger and you go across the entire first fret, second finger is going to go to the G string on the second fret, third finger on the A on the third fret, and the pinky is going to go to the D on the third fret. And if you strum all those together, that sounds an F major chord and it sounds really, really happy. But a good substitute for that, especially if you want to avoid the bar chord, is something called F major 7. And when we play F major 7, first finger is going to go to the B on the first fret, second finger on the G string on the second fret, and third finger on the D string on the third fret. And if you kind of strum just the D, G, B, and E, kind of the skinny four strings, that sounds like F major 7. And that's basically our four chords through the song. Actually, we got kind of A minor, G major, C major, F major, A minor, G major, C major, F major, very, very beginning, it almost sounds like we do kind of two downs and they kind of kill the strings on each chord. So you have kind of A minor with kind of down, down, kill it, G down, down, kill it, C down, down, kill it, F down, down, kill it, A minor down, down, kill it, G down, down, kill it, C down, down, kill it, F down, down, kill it. But a lot of times for myself to kind of support my voice, I like using some things called strum patterns. And one of my favorite strum patterns for a 4 4 like this is down, down, up, up, down, up. So you took that A minor and just tried that a lot. You have down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. So we tried that through our chord progression. We have A minor with a down, down, up, up, down, G, down, down, up, up, down, C, down, down, up, up, down, up, F, down. like this too is bass notes and a lot of times like the first down then of the down down up up down you throw in a bass note for the chord so on the a minor you can play the a string for your bass and then kind of keep your down up up down up so a minor with an a bass down up up down and on the g chord you'd have the low e string for your bass low e bass down up up down on the c you'd have the a string for your bass this is with an a bass down up up down and then with the f major seven and you'd have the D for your bass. And then for the F major bar, um, we'd be using the low E string for our bass down. So another option would be kind of doing kind of a bass down, up, up, down, up. So we tried that through our progression. We have A minor with an A bass, down, up, up, down, G with low E bass, down, up, up, down, C with an A bass, down, up, up, down, F the bass, down, up, up, down, G with an A bass, down, up, up, down, G with low E bass, down, up, up, down, C with an A bass, down, up, up, down, up for the bass, down, up, up, down, up. Now another strum pattern I think really kind of works well with the tune too is kind of a long down and then a down, down. It's down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up. So we tried it that way. That A minor with down, 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 to the down, 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 to the down, 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 up, down, up, down. A minor with an A bass, down, down, G with the bass, down, down, C with an A bass, down, down, F with the bass, down, down, A with an A bass, down, down, G with the bass, down, down, C with an A bass, down, down, F with the bass, down, down, up. Or if you're a little bit more adventurous, you could kind of.
where you, you kind of hear some stop time on the F where you may want to just do kind of a down kill it kind of idea. But for the most part, that's our chord progression through our verse and our chorus and, and through this whole, the whole song. Um, now the weird part is to play along with Avril Lavigne though, instead of starting on an A minor chord, she's actually starting on a C minor chord. So what you want to do to play along with the recording is take a capo, and if you put the capo on third fret, then now your A minor is really a C minor chord, your G major is really a B flat major chord, and your C major is really an E flat major chord, and your F major is really an A flat major chord. But to take it from the very, very beginning, you may want to try kind of that down, down, kill it idea, just to kind of start it off. Because that might be kind of a good way that people go, oh my gosh, it's rock and roll, it's rock and roll. <laughs> down, down, kill it, C, down, down, kill it, F, down, down, kill it. Or if you're just looking for a way to kind of back up your voice, you could try down, down, up, up, down, up. Then you have A minor with down, down, up, up, down, G, down, down, up, up, down, C, down, down, up, up, down, F, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, down. Basics of how you get strung through rock and roll by Avril Lavigne. So good luck!